to the Y. To the Y. The radio station with more. You're listening to the radio station. You're listening to. You're listening to. This is Radio Pia. Radio Pia. This is my song for freedom. He takes the beat. They call me Chris Jokey. Even though I walk through the valley of shadow of death, I fear no evil. For it's no God that my soul is with me.
Yes, uh, once again, fellow beer friends, lovers of freedom, men and women of goodwill, conscientious people, wherever you are all over the world. I say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and to some of you, good night, depending on your time zone. This is still Radio Biafra Extra, and we are streaming live through Radio Biafra London. Radio Biafra London is being anchored by the deputy leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. His name is Mazi Uchi Ukafo Mefo. He is from Abatete. Abatete is in Anambra State, and Anambra State is Biafra land. Mazi Uchi Ukafo Mefo is the man who has simply assured us that he will not allow the heart of this project to see corruption. I do not expect you to understand the mindset behind those words, but one day we shall. He is standing in a deputizing capacity on behalf of our Supreme Leader, Mazen Nandi Okukano, the King of Afari Beku, the one and the only man who stood up to speak for the collective interest of Biafran people for almost 60 years now. He is from Afari Beku. Afari Beku is in Umwahia. Umwahia is in Abia State. And Abia State is Biafra land. He is the director of Radio Biafra as well as Biafra Television. And of course, without wasting much of our time, I remember George Unibi. I come from Abo. Abo is in Delta State. And Delta State is Biafra land. This morning, we shall proceed to acknowledge the creator, Chuku Kika Biyama, the one who has set our feet upon this path that we must follow. For in the end, we are gone as a people without this divinely intervention. And so I humble myself before him this morning. That we may say that you are good and all the miracles you've done has brought us joy. And we are blessed and all the hope we have we place in you, O Lord, that we may say that you are good. And all the miracles you've done has brought us joy. And we are blessed. And all the hope we have, we place you, O Lord. For you are holy, O Father, we declare that we love you. We declare an everlasting love for you. Ide machineke, ide ma, ide ma nizie, ide ma, ide machineke mu, ide ma, ide ma nizie, ide ma, ide machineke mu, ide ma isi, ide ma nizie, ide ma u, ani na jage ma u. Nejuku ni busomai e honanya ni nagi ubiomagi ojuru anyanya dadu inwe ge mbangwe odi onye di kage e bu afa no mega anyi ni ni na sena ne de mau Unye de kage, unye de kage, unye de kadadi chineke odi unye de kage. Ise, ise, ise. And of course, this morning, as always, we will continue. Our topic is simply titled "True Reflection." Nigeria and Biafra, a true reflection of the imperialist nation over Africa. We continue saying it and 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 saying it. We will not stop saying it until we see clear evidence that you have been liberated. We will continue saying it because we understand the power in the world. We are fighting at different range, at different stage, at different dispensation, at different time. But we will overcome at the end of the day. 
And so in case you are tired of hearing and then you are not here delivered. God himself will not have created the word according to the Bible except God spoke. And that is why the Bible says, and God said, and God said, and God said, and a day will come, generation yet unborn, Biafran generation, including Fulani and Yoruba, and all those who have left us here, they will say that we say, and that we say, and after saying, and then we shall do. But how will you understand what is going on? When they are pointing you to one direction, you are going to another direction. When they call you to do something else, you are doing another thing. But I do not blame you. Considering how many years, over 200 years, they have reconditioned us. If any of us today can still stand up and say the truth without fear of evil. And then believe me, every reason why we have come out here must come to pass. They must be fulfilled in our lifetime. And so when we come, we keep telling you. We can speak hundred words in a second. But I tell you, only one is meant to set us free. Only one. And once you understand that the reason why we are here is freedom, and you start shouting freedom, the idiot will not give you away. But of course, we cannot deny ourselves. For us to appreciate where or what we are really doing, let us come back to a particular point and then let us make it clear. Nigeria and Biafra are true reflection of the imperialist nation over Africa. The same way a lot of people are so concerned about when is demolishing a hotel, go and find out what is going on. Go and find out why he demolished the hotel. The same way some people are busy looking at uh, people who say they are, they are, they are uh, different, different names. The liquid metal, the metal liquid and the rest of them. You people open your eyes. All these are distractions from the Fulani. All these are the distractions from the enemy of Biafra. Because all these people cannot add a penny value to your life. If your brother is the owner of the hotel, go and find out what he did. If your brother is Odumeje or Zubi, go and advise them. If you buono, if you mono, Fulani are there. They are ready to ravage and rape your women once again. And people are like, hey, they are breaking out there. Hey, they are locking down. Oh, may the Lord be with all of you. The action of the imperialist nation is such that each time it is being said, each time we try to reflect this to our children, most of us would say it like a fairy tale. You make it so beautiful. You don't know how much I hate you when you think they colonized Africa. You don't know how much I hate you when you can justify, come out and justify that we needed to be colonized. You don't know how much I hate you when you think Africans don't have brain. You don't know how much I hate you when you speak against my ancestors. You don't know how much I hate you. Because the enemy did their job well. The imperialists came, they played game with us. We just makasa, and all of us yielded. Today, people who cannot brush their teeth are the one telling you that your mouth is smelling. Today, people who don't know how to bath. Your ancestors taught them how to bath. They are the ones now giving you cream to rub. Today, as we speak, people who don't have moral are the ones teaching you morality. When you see them gallivanting all over the world, telling you about justice, equity, you think they are human beings, but their actions speak otherwise. But how can you stand up and face this nonsense? If you are able to comprehend the truth behind their action. What is happening in Biafra land didn't start today. Many a times I have presented to you topics that I, want to, that I want you to understand that they are the same people, but they use different strategy. It is the same vehicle, just that they are different driver. And today, considering the single fact that everything they have been doing from time immemorial, it is the same formula. And if we do not get acquainted with it, we are gone as a people. We cannot be repeating the same mistake over and over again. This is another hero's remembering day. The month of May. How did we get here? The imperialists came in here, pillaged our land, ravaged everything, destroyed everything. The same way Nigeria is doing to Biafra. And people cannot see it. 
But I tell you, any man or woman who have hope in Nigeria, everything you have hoped for, everything you have labored for in Nigeria, it doesn't matter whether you are in heaven or you are earth, on earth. It doesn't matter whether you are Fulani, Yoruba, Wosa, or Igbo, or Niger, Delta, Delta, Niger, any how they call you, Medo, Bed, Bed, Medo. It doesn't matter. Anyone who has sold any seed to Nigeria, you have sold to the wide wind. You will reap corruption. We come here, we tell you what is going on. People are allowing themselves to be distracted. If I open my mouth, cure on a disease. Some people will not come here and talk nonsense. We can demolish your hotel. We can demolish your hotel. The media is doing this. All these things. Are you people not ashamed when you are talking about it? If every governor has stood like we can, idiot Alamajiri will not be here. Am I supporting him? I'm not supporting him. Do you know how many influx of Alamajiri standing army, soldier waiting order to kill you? You are here talking about hotel when they will soon demolish all your house. Nikome, Nikome, I'm coming for all of you. Because you don't have shame. And I want to hear people telling me that there are influx of Alamajili. Or don't you people understand that the Alamajili they are bringing into Biafra land? It's not the same Alamajili they are taking to Yoruba land. I've watched everybody make comment on this of this Alamajili issue. Do you know that the Alamajili they are bringing to Biafra land are not the same age grade with the one they are taking to Yoruba land? These people are, are fooling us. All of us are there yapping. I want you to go back to history. Look at Yoruba race and land. Oh, they are bringing Alamajili. They took Alamajili of three years, seven years, nine years to Yoruba land. And then they are bringing the ones between 17 to 35 years into Biafra land. And when you are shouting, Yoruba is shouting. Omoteku is there to control those small, small Alamajili. Can't you see what is at stake? And some idiot will collect money and come here to be distracting us. Do you think the age grade of Alamajili they are shipping to Biafra land? You think they are the same grade of Alamajili they are shipping to Yoruba land? I don't know why we can keep white and allow Yoruba to be deceiving us, both with Juju and everything. This rain will follow Okamonyu Kulonyenta. If it is not for the interest of Biafra that we are here, every other thing we are doing, we are going to lose. But I say, may Elohim be praised. There is no two ways about that. And those of you who don't like me calling Yoruba, when you are telling me about your Yoruba blood, don't forget I have Fulani blood in my family. Then let us protect Fulani blood. Because I have Fulani blood in my family. I don't know why our people don't understand. Very soon you begin to hear the gun. Let's see if those people who will be in diaspora will come and take the bullet for us. Let me not be distracted a little bit. I don't understand. As we are speaking every night, Fulani are coming. Is it not the other day they stop one? Day before yesterday they stop one in on the Chahed Bridge. Fulani who cannot brush his teeth. Peter the vehicle as pressmen. I'm parabolating at exactly 3.35 a.m. They are pressed. What are they pressing? Let us not... I mean lose focus anyway nigeria and biafra a true reflection of the imperialist nation over africa the imperialist nation they have succeeded in giving themselves name when i was in school as a child in those days they teach us history they say when the colonial master came when the colonial master came when the colonial master came these are terrorists who did they master? These are terrorists like Boko Haram, Fulani Hetzman, Miat Yala. Anybody who tells you he's a colonial master, he's just a terrorist. Look at Nigerian atrocity against humanity. Yet they are trying to project their image across the globe that they are human beings. These are terrorists. Any Nigerian person is a terrorist. What is happening in Nigeria today is exactly what the imperialists did, the terrorists themselves. That is why they can only go assassinate good men and call them terrorists. Whereas they are the real terrorists. From Portugal to Rome to Britain to any country that ever colonized anybody in the world, you are a terrorist. This is who you really are. The 
terrorists came and stole the resources in Africa. And then they claim they are giving to Africa. The same way the Nigerians are stealing from Biafra land and pretending to be helping Biafra. The wealth of Africa fills the whole world. And each time I see that, I hear, oh, World Health Organization want to help Africa. Oh, Big Gate want to help Africa. Oh, America is here to help Africa. Oh, China and Japan want to help Africa. Oh, we have brought all of them to help Africa. Britain, all of them. I weep for your hopelessness. Africa filled the world. Most of you don't know. America is collecting alloy like a million from Kogi State, Biafra land. Why do you think that they still in Alaja, Alaja steel industry is not working? It's not working, but America must collect alloy like a million from there. Britain will come and help Nigeria to have a, 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 a territorial integrity. But Britain are stealing the oil in Biafra land. China are now in the northern part of Nigeria, stealing gold and diamond. And they are coming to help us, idiot everywhere. But will Nigeria learn? How many years now our leader have been telling you, you are being ruled by a, a robot. High intelligent artificial robot is ruling you. Some people are still trying to absorb it. I want you to check it. The people who came, they stole gold. They steal even up to bead. Elephant talk. They steal everything stealable. They are still stealing today. World Bank, we want to help Africa. World Bank, World Bank, my feet. Without the wealth of Africa, no nation in the world will talk the way they are talking. But of course, we have accepted it. United Nations is there. World Health Organization is there. World Bank is there. The very money they steal from us, we will praise them for them. Idiot everywhere. Fool and who cannot, who use Keto to watch their nash every minute. Idiot will bring curse upon themselves, not us. Don't this thing make you get angry? We are Biafra. They are stealing the resources from our land. And then one idiot who cannot brush his teeth with Yoruba, attach idiot will come here and tell you, hey, we want to tie and it's a second head bridge. We want to give you both presidency. Who the hell are they? Don't you understand how they function? They imperially steal the wealth of Africa. And each time they create problem in Africa, they come back coming to play God. Hey, yes, sir, we want to help Africa. Nobody, African don't need your help. You get out of Africa and go and face your own civilization. They continue to loot the resources of Africa in collaboration with so many organizations. And they pretend to help Africa. In the same way, Nigeria loot the resources of Biafra land and pretend to be doing us a favor. Each time they have the privilege of carrying out a minor project in Biafra land. Just the same way. You loot everything in Africa. You are pretend, oh, we are helping Africa. Big Gate is coming to inject Africa. That thing Big Gate is planning will kill his generation. Most of them have access to time travel machine. But this you can con con consider as a, how do they say it? They say it's a, 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 how do they use this grammar? Conspiracy theory. In case you don't know, men and women have access already to time travel machine. But they won't let you know it. And then they are jumping up and down. But that thing will trap all of you. Very soon I hear Big Gate is dead because that dead man should not be so wicked trying to poison Africa. I'm talking about Big Gate, another idiot collaborating with him, including Water Organization and China. And then all of a sudden they disappear. All of a sudden they reappear. You people will be trapped, trapped into a time where you know nothing about. Idiots everywhere. The reason we insult them, the reason we cause them, so that you know they are hopeless animal. They are not human beings. Gone at the day, they say, oh, Oibo is going to come, the Oibo is going to help us. Oh, Oibo is coming to kill us. According to my leader and one of his brokers in 2014, he said they, they tried to pamper you, and they were singing, oh, we are the war, we are the children. They sing, black is beautiful, black is beautiful. All those pampering, they pamper us. Where did it take us to? We are 100 years backward than we were in the 80s. 
I witnessed my mother count 4,000 naira to buy tear rubber 404 Piju. I saw my mother count 11,000 naira to buy trailer in Abo in the 80s. We went to buy moto. We go to buy moto like people buying tomato. We just go to a shop where they sell vehicle. My, my parents will say, this pick up, how much? They say, it's 4,000 naira or 4,500. Uh, 4, my mother said, no, 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 no. I'm giving you 4,000 naira. They say, ah, mama, this one is evolution. Oh. Mama, this one is evolution. This one is evolution. They say, ah, mama, this one is evolution. No. My mother said, I don't want evolution. It's pick up I want. Take the evolution. They bought trailer. My parents bought trailer in my presence. In the 80s, early 80s, 11,000 naira. Idiot, we are progressing, we are progressing. All the money you will loot as a Biafran politician or Nigerian politician, you scatter across the globe. What can it do for you? Are you people not ashamed? They conspire with one another. They conspire with international communities. Just to make our chain heavier than we can bear or resist. The same way Nigeria is running across the globe, looking for any country to share the looting from Biafra land and help them sustain the zoo called Nigeria. The imperialists, they know what they did in Berlin Conference. In Berlin Conference, they gathered, the gathering of the virtue. That is what I call Berlin Conference. Britain, no. He alone cannot be able to hold Africa down. Portuguese, no. They cannot hold it down for so long. Including German and every other idiot who enslaved Africa. You came to people's land. They opened up for you. They welcome you. You turn around, you rob them. You are the one projecting, uh, 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 what do they call it? You know, some people will say, hey, how do we get a uh, uh, freedom if we curse all these people? Thunder will fire all these people because they cause our problem in the first place. And then let them make our chain heavier. Let everybody suffer very well. Let us see where they will land. Is it King Leopard or King Leopard of uh, Belgium? Who killed people in Africa? Till tomorrow morning. Go and ask Belgium. What is your private jet doing into every, in, in every remote villages? Where King Leopard cut people's hand off. They are still stealing. They even celebrate uh, 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 hand chopping up. With the chocolate cake. Till tomorrow morning. All of you are idiot and hopeless. This is exactly what Nigeria is doing to us. Britain cannot sustain the robot in Asu Rock. And what did they do? Fulani have run to China. And China now are everywhere, poisoning everybody. Doing the work of Big Gate for them. Vultures everywhere. Here in Biafra now, it is our resources. And then you want you, you want people to respect your nation. But you are a criminal. You are a common thief. You are a common thief. Each time you send your people away from their continent to invade Africa, any community in Africa, know that you are a thief. China is everywhere, borrowing us money. You go and print money. You come and borrow us. Every evil you people have done to Africa, it is going to boomerang on all of you. The hulobalo you have caused in the life of Africa will solely boomerang on all of you. Kingdom rise and kingdom fall. China was stealing American technology. American relax. Look at what China is doing today. And I tell you, America has another Soviet Union to fight. If they don't better up. But of course, China will fall like Soviet Union. Any country that is built on the expense of people, if you do not make compensation, all of you will fall. We have seen the Babylonians, the Medias and the Persia, the Grecians and the Romans. We have seen all of them. They rise one day and they fall one day. Let Africa go. Let Africa free. And the beginning of the freedom of Africa is Biafra land. Tell me one country in Africa that is free. We are the one bringing them to enslave us. South Africa may be politically free, but economically they are slaves. What is freedom if it doesn't come in its totality? That you will not understand.
the imperialist or the king of Africa, everything in Africa, they took it in different form of shape. The same way here in Biafra land. Everything that concerns us, the Fulani, the Yoruba, the Awosa, they're stealing it and making use of our brain. They rob everything that we have. They run about killing Biafras. Just to take what we have. Today we are sitting down here. You know, it's amazing. It's quite funny. They say they are locking everywhere down for COVID-19. And then all of a sudden, every night you begin to see trailer loaded with people. Loaded with people. Bumping into, into, into Biafra land. The number of people coming into Biafra land under lock and key. It's more than the number of people that have come in when they open border for them. And everybody is keeping quiet. They are still speaking English so that you respect them. They are all taught and criminals. And you come out and do what is necessary. Idiot will say, oh, he's killing us. He's killing us. Who is killing you? Mini ni rezu no kezue u. Ese ni mbumbu mini amangu nyabo. Mini ni ruto no kezue u. What are they coming to do in Biafra land? We do not have federal government present. We don't have company industries or industry. They are the one who have destroyed it. The only thing we have now is to ride keke na pepe. They have stole the money from our land. Buy motorcycle for their people. They are the one doing it. Market Junction, where we sell my nothing. They are the one controlling it. Our mother who decide to go to the farm. If they either meet full any herdsmen that will rape them and murder them, or the cow will destroy their crop. What are they coming to do? Because we really don't have anything. If you talk, governors begin to kill you. This period of lockdown, do you notice that ninety percent of the security people locking down Biafra land are also full and Yoruba? This is the same thing they did. When the Perelis came, they gave gun to our son Yoruba to be killing our people. If you know what they did, just that is exactly what is going on in Biafra land. We are fighting with Facebook. We are fighting with satellites. We are fighting with Yoruba Gota Media. Fighting with BBC. We are fighting with our politicians. We are fighting with ourselves. We are fighting with Indochina and Yama. We are fighting with everything. But this time now, they want to give us the fight for real. And then you tell me you are, you are a Biafran person. You are, you are opening leg for Yoruba. You are romancing Yoruba. And I was a fool. And may the Lord have mercy on you. Can't you see their game? I just told you now. You people are not following it. Go and look at Alamajiri, they drop in Yoruba land. These are small, small children who cannot fight. The mature one, the main trained one are in our land. And we are crying, we are shouting, we are asking you. It's not because it really mean. We understand many will die, both guilt and innocent. But I think if we must die, if we must die, we will decide how we die. If I, George Onibe, must die because of this issue, I will tell you how I will die. You will not tell me. And after your encounter with me, you will not pray to have a encounter with another Biafra. Don't you understand the time that we are in? But what am I trying to say in essence? Biafra, like African countries, must be united in their suffering in order to survive the stampede there is stampede on biafran already for us to survive don't let them buy you over we must be united in our suffering that is one of the way we can survive this stampede a gala biafran wake up they know you before you know them and they will come for you Idoma Biafra, wake up, they know you already and they will come for you. If you like say you are not Biafra, you are Biafra. They know you. 
they know you, they will come for you. Even those who are not Biafran are waking up and they are coming home. We are still here trying to create line in terms of ethnic, ethnic uh, 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 borders. Some just still say, oh, we are not Biafra, we are Niger Delta. Some Igbo are still saying, oh, oh, we be nani, oh, we are not Biafra, and they are everywhere. Some other people are still shouting, everybody are still shouting, if we do not unite on one borderline, all of you get ready. But of the truth, they cannot conquer us. This is one truth that I know. This is the time where we must all rise up to stop this evil. Do not take side with the Nigerian state as a Biafra because you will be abandoned like those who aided and abated the imperialist. Don't take side. They are coming. But before they come, they will buy many of us. They are going to buy many of us. They have succeeded in bringing in ammunition. They are loaded in every mocks and barracks in Biafra land. Most of you will forget that four or five years ago, they were busy building barrack everywhere. Everywhere in Biafra land. Project of barrack is completed. The number of barrack they need is completed. They start dropping ammunition everywhere, every mosque, every night. Trailer is bringing in ammunition in Biafra land. And now this is the final stage. They are bringing in the men, the foot soldier. But am I telling you so that you become uh, afraid? No. I am telling you so that you open your eye and trust nobody. Because this time they will buy some of us. They will pay them handsomely. They will fish us out. They will put us to flight. But be not troubled because they will not conquer. Do not say you are not aware. We have told you. Be not troubled because they cannot conquer us. And then after they think they have concluded their plan, they will descend on us. They will burn us down to ashes. But I tell you the truth. From these ashes, the pure Biafran, the genuine Biafran nation will arise. And then it will be too late for them. Because there is nothing any of them can do. I'll be back in a minute.
at this moment our lines are open do not forget this is may 30th of may we we'll remember our fallen heroes and heroines do not forget or misunderstand us we don't hit anybody our clumsiness has made us give in to a lot of nonsense and if we do not begin to excavate all this truth make them beat like part of our beating heart we will make the same mistake Look at how much Yoruba, Wosa, Fulani have gang up. How much determined they are to blot out this tiny Biafra. It will look as if we have committed any crime against them. Is there anything we did to them? Of course, at this moment, our lines are open. Our WhatsApp line is 070-815-45642. 070 Four five six four two is our WhatsApp line, and our direct line is zero eight one two two one five two nine seven one. Our direct line, once again, I repeat, is zero eight one two two one five two nine seven one, and the special number for the female is zero eight one two eight eight five eight six one four. Special number for the female. We have an announcement to make. 30th of May is very, very critical. We have our 30th of May, we must not forget. We are going to have three days of fasting and prayer, starting from the 27th to end midnight of the 29th. It's very, very important. We are going to read and pray all the Psalms in the Holy Book. From Psalm number 1 to 150, if you read 10 Psalms, you pray prayer and fasting for three days and then conclude it with a prayer on the midnight of the 29th and then this year we are going to have a candlelight vigil, a procession in the middle of the night ushering in the 30th of May. We have sat at home so much that I will also encourage people to sit at home on that very day please for us to honor those that thoughts that we may live. Yes, a caller on the line. Are you there? Your name and where are you calling from? Call I'm on the line. From my name is Mr. Siri Wambobo. Uh, my name is Mr. Siri Wambobo. Go ahead, please. Uh, whatever they are doing, uh, whatever they are doing, we are ready for them. So nobody should shoot. We are ready at any given time. So I myself am ready to be free. And also everybody in the in the Japan land can never change because they have suffered us in a lot. So thank you. Go on on what you are doing to the Japan. May God continue to help you and keep you so that we all will see Japan in Jesus name. You see, you see. Of course, they understand. If they like, let the, the whole world gather in Biafra land. The, we shall see how it ends. We are trying to manage collateral damage. We are trying to make sure you are not murdered in your sleep. It really doesn't matter what you are doing, what you are up to, whether you like it or not. In Fechukude, Ude Gualaya, we are still telling you, just wake up so that they will not lynch you while you are sleeping. Just wake up and monitor everywhere they are. Go and organize yourself. If they must give us a blow, they will not go back without receiving it back. Somebody cannot come from God nowhere and chase us and terrorize us in our land. Enough of all this nonsense. That is what we are saying here. 
Call on WhatsApp. Are you there? Good morning. Good morning from here. How about you? Good morning, sir. My name is Anthony Patrick Udo. I come from a Bible state in the Afro land. It's a good to be a blessing. Mas you guys, you no matter anything where the zoo do, they will not win us. We must win the zoo. The zoo must fall. I believe that. My leader said the zoo must fall, and the zoo is falling. Let me talk to my people in my diary. You talk at me, Miss Hero. Talk at me, Buck. You get that little Buck. Then I want to go. Well, I'm going to make sure give me a stop here from me. You pay me a decade, that get that. Okay, look at the jeep. You know, boy, it's okay. Good, you take a jeep, get a 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 Thank God you bless very you. much, my brother. We are not going anywhere. Of course, the message is clear. Our people must understand. They cannot do anything. All those people, they, they come in with the trailer and gongoru. They will run with the ordinary leg. I keep repeating this thing. When this thing will start, they will forget their bossa. But if our people fail to pay attention to what is happening, no governor will be safe. Nobody will be safe. No army brigadier or general. All of you here in Biafra land, you will see what you are not ready for. That is why when we come on this platform and say, get ready to go home, we know what we are telling you. I can assure you that a lot of things will happen that nobody has even thought about. You are still doing fine, boy. You are going to Yoruba church. We are still doing fine boy, fine woman, intellectual. We have them. We have them in IPOB. We are asking you to save yourself. Onyindiro waburuburu. Kenyo neme. Ana angomanya. Hero. Fine boy. Ne ilina aba. Manandiro waburuburu. Eche fuku anano nye chi ne che. Ne che unwe ya. Don't relax and let anybody distract you. People come and, and, and look at, eh, oh, we can demolish a uh, mosque, oh, we can demolish a uh, hotel, oh, do me do, oh, do 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 What does, uh, what benefit is all these things giving to us? My brother on WhatsApp, are you still there? Mazio your Google. Yeah, I'm there. George Onibe, the morning, Africa rep. <laughs> Good morning. Nice to talk to you again today. Uh, George Onyibe, you know, at the beginning, when I hear your name is African rape, I was, I was not happy. <laughs> you know why I was not happy is because I'm thinking, do you really know the magnitude of being an African rape? Uh, George Onyibe, I bow down to you today because you're blessed. Maze, I, uh, am, I am humble. I am humble. It's just <laughs> a privilege. Believe me, there are dogged yeah. Biafran that have not even said a word. They are the ones I look from within the shadow. And I can tell you it is a privilege and I'm humbled. I must tell you. It's yeah, a privilege. Please ahead, tell them please. tell them tell them to join, please. I of can course listen they, they to your summer. The they are on the ship already. They are on the yeah. ship already. Women all money zoo among one. Go yeah. ahead. Yo, the rain will fall and the new nation will emerge. That is area I want to talk about. Yeah. Uh friends, please. It's time to go home. Uh, governors in Biafra land, please make land available for farming. A new model of farming tractors should be available so that we build our new nation. Um, uh, I want to speak to my people in Anioma. Please, everybody should get pen and paper. I want you to join us before I start calling the number. Please get pen and paper, people from Anioma. George Onibe, you see this imperialist here, yeah, George Onibe. These people didn't do anything for us. These people are very wicked. That is so exactly the same people, thing Nigerians are doing to us. Yoruba and Aousa oh. are doing to us. They are the one punishing oh. us and we are the one praising them. 
The imperialists came oh. raping, murdering like Fulani headsmen, killing everybody, yeah. reposition us and we praise them. Oh, his Britannic Majesty, Queen of England. Of course, that is what she are. And every other idiot who raped Africa and robbed Africa. Till today, their private jets are everywhere in every remote village in Biafra, in Biafra land and of course, Africa at large. Stealing day and night. But yet, World Bank will come and borrow us money. The same money they stole from us. The Queen of England is rich, fatted with the resources stolen from slaves. They made out of us. Turned us to beast of burden. We built cities in the world we are not allowed to enter. And yet we, 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 we give them accolade. For what? Go ahead, please. Uh, yeah, Jojo, if you go and check the banks in UK, yeah? The banks in UK, even where you cannot even take a loan to, to buy a single car, go and check who owns that bank. You will see the money they make is from the slavery. But yet black people cannot even get a loan. To, to, to be able to get a single car. That is how we are, you understand? You know the thing about it is, I am telling one white man, I say, you people say black people are rubbish. I don't know why every one of you keep quiet in the issue of Biafra. You are not talking, everybody keep quiet because you know, we are different people, but he didn't respond to it because he knows I'm a Biafra. We will we, we go home, time is time to go home. Uh, I hope uh, I know my people, your telephones are ready. Your pens and paper are ready. Please, I urge you, my people in Anioma, this is a good girl from Akuku. Uh, please, can you join our forum where we exchange ideas, uh, especially we in, we in diaspora. We want to empower our own people in, in Biafra land so they can, they can get ready to fight for a new cause because Biafra is good for everyone. Uh, the telephone number is plus three. Nine three five one two five five six three six six. I repeat plus three nine three five one two five five six three six six. Please don't be rude when you call the number. We will, I want you to join the forum. We have to be there in order we exchange ideas, please. Uh, I, I am telling you, DSS, DSS, and the agent of DSS, if you know you are strong and you are capable to confront we and your my people, come and join. But make sure you tell us you are, you are agent of DSS, which you can never do. If you think you can handle us, come there and join us. Let's give you a treatment. George, let me drop because Thank I you know too many people much. like you. We Thank you for taking you. my call. Thank you. Are you there, caller on WhatsApp? Are you still there? Yes, sir. I'm there, sir. Thank you for holding on. Go ahead, please. No problem, sir. Uh, my lord, good morning. Good morning, Biafra. Good morning, friends of and the way we share our freedom. My lord, my name is DK. I'm calling from Paris. Uh, it has been a long time I never hear from you, Chief. Mazi. Uh, please accept my condolence, you know, since then your brother left, I, I haven't met you, I've been thinking about you, knowing, saying, God, where are you? But one of my friends told me you are fine, he called you on WhatsApp, he spoke to you, he said you are fine, so I thank God for that. My Lord, the message today, I pick what defeat us. No matter what, no matter if they like, let them bring a ship load. They will not defeat us because we are the indigenous. You can't come to my house and defeat me. It's impossible. Mazi, Asim Chineke Gozege, I'm very, very happy to hear your voice again. Keep the good work in. Let the ball roll. I say, may God chuko kiabi ama bless you and your family. Thank you, sir, for picking my. And God be with you. Yes, a caller on the line. Are you there? Yes, I'm there. Good morning, Church Emily. Good morning from here. Go ahead, please. Okay. Good morning, my fellow dear friends all over the world, wherever you are. Good morning, my leader. May God Almighty bless and keep you. My deputy leader, may Elohim be your guide and your shepherd. My brother, Onibe, what you are saying is the correct thing. Do I continue? Of course, the word is listening. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. 
please, what you are saying is the correct thing. Because our people are not sleeping. They don't want to wake up. They have seen all these alamajis all over, all these food soldiers. And by this time, we are still having people that are still being uh, sabo and all the rest. We need to wake up and take the uh, bull, the bull by the horn, so that they, w these people will not overrun us. So our governors that are doing sabo tour that are slaves to, to, to alamajis, this is the time because they will kill you. You will think that they will kill a tiny man or woman. It's you that is a danger. So you better check, wake up and go and check all the mosques and attack them, check them, then monitor them. Then our people should not be sleeping all over. Our youth wake up. If you are not at IPOB, please join. This is the time, this is the hour, so that these people will not overrun us. They pretend that they have COVID, but they don't have it. They just poison their people so that they will... Uh, uh, distribute Alamad Jewish, they will distribute their soldiers to our land, and this is what they are doing now. This is the time. My name is Yukeda Chuku from Isha Alamba. No, Judge Onibe, I will thank God for your life and for everything. I have not reached you since you lost your brother, but I believe that the good Almighty will grant him eternal rights and give you the strength to bear the loss. So we are praying for you all the days of our, our life that God will bless you, bless your family, make you to see Biafra and beyond. And whosoever says that you will not see Biafra, may the land of Biafra open up and swallow that person. My leader will see Biafra and beyond. And whosoever that is working evil against my leader, the word of God says that those that seek for our lives shall die for our sake. As many as are trying to drink our blood, they all shall be dropping in their own blood. Our hands are clean. If we, if we are dragging the land of Yoruba, let them overrun us. If you are dragging the land of Arewa and the Fulanis, uh, uh, let them overrun us. But if we are what, we are, what we are asking is our legitimate right, let the God of justice, the God of justice, the God of equity, the God of righteousness, open his mouth and swallow them. As he swallowed the people of Syria when they came to overrun the people of Judea, hoping that the people of Judea are small and they have no strength. They don't know that it is not he that run it or he that will it, but it's by the mercy of God that war conquer. And we have God of war. God of war will swallow them up. As they come in, in one way, the God Almighty will scatter them and swallow them in many ways. So shh. The fact that we, we are not, we alone, the fact Of course, we, we lost that caller. Zoo Epileptic Network. But having said that, thank you very much, the last caller. Having said that, people must understand. Biafras must understand. We are not in a panicking mood. We are not going to panic for anybody. It's just simple. Yoruba, our fathers don't want to stay with you. You can go and marry all our sisters, pregnant them, let them have children for you, bus stop, that you will turn to Alamajiri tomorrow. Because that is what you people do. Awosa, if you like, let them conquer you. Then make them conquer everybody. Fulani, if you like, be jumping up and down, you are born to rule. Is the message not clear to you people? We want to go home. We want to be on our own. Be our friends who are sleeping. Niko me, niko me, yako nyera jabofia. Niko me, niko me, yako nyera jaba in mafia. They will attack, we know. But we will reciprocate. You should know that also. They will kill us, yes, we know. We will kill them. Don't you know the prophecy? They will kill us and we will kill them. Biafra will come in the end. Is it not Biafra land? Is it not Biafra land? But to survive, we need to put everything we have together. Stop dashing Yoruba people money. By the grace of God in the evening, we shall look at Yoruba, your Yoruba pastor. Ordinary COVID-19. Have you not exposed their hypocrisy? How long are we going to speak these words before you understand that we are not here to joke with anybody? We didn't come here to make friends. Our leader have put something in motion. 
He can't even stop it. Chukwo Kikabiyama has used our leader, His Royal Highness, Mazen Nandi Okukano, to put something in motion. He cannot stop it. But don't worry. We will tell the story how it all began and how it all end. Yoruba leave us alone. Awosa leave us alone. Fulani leave us alone. Nde Sabo leave us alone. Call on the line. Are you there? Hello, man. Good morning. Good morning from here. Call on Waza. Please hold on for me. Go ahead, man. Good morning, man. I'm going to continue to keep you. Keep our leader and be crazy. Keep Mazi in Temerfo. May Elohim continue to protect and guide you people. Mazi, I thank God for the wisdom of Yahweh upon your life. You see, everything you've just said, it's just like the prophecy from the synagogue on Shabbat. These people are ready to fight. But the prophecy said that they are not sure that they are going to win us. But they are ready, they are trying to start their attack at any moment. So be friends all over the world, do not be afraid because this war, they will never win it. They will never. Because our forefathers enter covenant with everything on this planet Earth. No matter what they do, they will not defeat us. You see this statement, may every person should take it seriously. And every prayer we prayed, Elohim has already answered it already. Take it seriously. Don't joke with this statue. All this uh, prayer, uh, three days prayer of fasting, Elohim has already answered it. And also the uh, prophecy from Shabbat, it says that an angel was marked. I don't, I, I, not, I don't really understand what it means, but it's marking his own people with one, one, one. I pray that their friends, and all of us that receive this mark will stay alive to see Biafra. The, the prophecy also says that people should, from from this um this month of May, this month of May, people should be careful. Even in the market, anything you do, open your eyes. Don't relent. Just be very careful this time around. I pray that Elohim will continue to guide us and protect our leader. Thank you. In the much. name of Chukuti Kaviyawa. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Call on WhatsApp. Are you still there? Yes. Thank you for holding on. Uh, Go ahead, please. My name is Fremo, sir. Good morning. Uh, my name is Fremo. I'm calling you from Hadi Ibn Hadi Masin, Ibn Biafra Land. So I want to really appreciate you for your good work that you're doing for Biafra. France on the world. I want to thank I I really miss your voice when you we are upset. But but uh, I want to say that you should take heart for how what happened to go I'm really angry of forty forty thousand coming to Biafra and they are giving us full and alama without food. But I want to assure them that all oh, their plans will fail. We are beer friends. I used to tell them we are beer friends. In 1960 to 1967, we did it. So we are we are going to do it this time around. So I I promise I promise beer friends that. Hello. Go ahead, please. Hello, sir. Go ahead. Uh, I promise Biafra all over the all over the world, and mostly those in Biafra land, that they should not panic. Wiki is doing a great job. We, we praise that man. We said it. Anybody that do good, we praise him. If all you if you do bad, we also we come out and tell the world that you do bad. Governor Wiki is doing a great work, and we believe that we win our house of land, whether they like it or not. So I want to speak to uh, my dialect, please. Let me tell my people. Uh, Ndebema, ekilela muno, abo mga fono, chimezi ankwa, bika ala maapono, unu biku unu honye, ndebema lile biku honyane, eko malaho ndebema la radio biafra, biku ala maapono, ndebema, unu potala uge ruwe la nyo, unu free fresh elu le meani, shele ekwe nyani ndi, shele ekwe nyani anything, 
existed a, 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 a human with autism. Allow it to rise who may be my lily. You call him up one day, be my own who knew or to own who knew or to cheer for allow on who not to kindly live because fight her for beer from it, beer from Allah. Oh, you need to pan the mima. I delay it all in Abba. I should have Niger Delta, Niger Delta. More land in Niger Delta, Bunding Roy in Law Haji, more people mean your botella, but I highly linger Roy in. And then if I come beer from a coin, my coin, the yellow do oil in the Audi Fob. But I am a run pico, Ebe Malili, Ndoki, Ebe Mandes, Ebema, Unu, who knew to Macanda Fulania Patahala with Guon or Dunja or Dunja as on Sunday be my pico, Unu, who knew to Kai, Chai, Chai, Lily Chop, be a from Mangi, I'm a legend at Biafra, Bicon, Debe Malili, and you, Tabima, Umunga, Nibima, Umu Kabima, on a potabico, Kali, Uni Mazen, and the Kanaka. To have for beer from any time, I like it. So, my African rep, I want to really appreciate you. Continue with your good work. You I pray much. that Chukwu Kabama will bless you in the name of Chukwu Kabama. I pray. You see, so. call on the so. line. Hello. Yes. Hello, good morning, from Very here. nice man. Go ahead, please. What I want to say is this: It's only God that will fight this battle for us. We depend on God. Of the two others, the fight that God has fight that nobody can stop it. All our people in the Biafra land, God, the live God, is only God who win his battle. How God will do it, we don't know. But we believe in God. He's only God. All our people in the Afra land, be courage. God will give you the strength. He did it uh, in Israelite. We are the present Israelite in the Afra land. Be courage. Where a catapult, did a catapult. This is the, the catapult to a boat royal. Then God will give you more wisdom. How you will win this battle? We have already win it. We just for we just in a paper shop. We have already win this battle. Thus, only we believe in God that God will fight all this battle for us. All our people in the land is not easy. The God will not give you people strength. Or it is not easy. Or do easy? No, but don't be sure. Especially you, my son, you don't know why I'm calling you people, so I'm calling you that red white man. That time in that is it. Defending this for your enemies. Defending this our enemies. God will surely reward each and every one of us. And then we make this do the act. What person can you know why? Well, I'm asking this man this morning. We can be governor of your river state. Let me help other governors. Invitate them for them to be awake for their sleep. Let them to be awake. I pray that the God Almighty will fight this battle for us. At last, we will praise the Almighty God. In Jesus' name. I used to pray. Every morning I used to go to church and commit everything into the house of God. I used to book mass. That let God fight this thing because everything we need to do, we need to convert God from the beginning and to the end. And God will surely answer all this thing. At last, we will be great. It's well in Jesus' name. God Thank bless you. Thank you very sister. much. We must Thank continue. You. Yes, sir. Call on WhatsApp. Good morning. Good morning from here. Go ahead, please. Please, uh, Mazo Nibe, before I continue, my name's uh, Maze Mwabweze Akota. Mwabweze Akota is from Amandoba in uh, Isu, uh, Luji, uh, Biafra land. Mazo Nibe, I forgot, but please forgive me about your your loss. Please, let us bear the loss. I'm sorry, Mechuku Kikabia, my console, and uh, Re, re, repay you back for your loss, please. Mighty name of Chuko Kikagama, please let him console you and your family. I'm sorry for that. What happened? Uh, Mazio Nibe, 
about what is happening in the area that I'm staying. I took some time, move around over this uh, lockdown, and I found out that every uh, a, a, a strategic junction, you will see our safflane there if they are not selling uh, plant uh, 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 potato. They are doing uh, shoe workers. If they are not doing work, shoe workers, they are pushing baro. If they are not pushing baro, they are selling the uh, sweet and the chingom. If they are not doing that, every looks and cranny of Biafra land, in the market, in the street, even if along the road, you will not see them in the middle of the market. Where you see them is in the junction, every junction. Ask anybody to move around and check every junction. This is not uh, the the ones that are doing checking points. This is the Aosa Fulane. Every that, junction that is, you go. That is one thing. Our governors may not know this. That is why we are telling them. Everywhere they say lockdown. Everywhere it's not for Aosa Fulane and Yoruba. Anywhere they are securing our land in the name of lockdown. All of them are Fulane. All of them. All of them in our own community, but in their own land, they are doing no, the life is normal. Eh? When somebody contacts a uh, coronavirus in America, they cannot breathe. The one in China, they are falling and dying on the street. The one in Europe, all of them are having problems to protect to, 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 to breathe. But the, the coronavirus victim of Nigeria, they are protesting for more bon vita and more bread. This evil is too much, it's too much. And these people, they think they are intellectual and they are deceiving us. But there is no problem. Go ahead, please. So, Mazumi, I just move around and I start counting. I call somebody that is uh, scouting me. Look at what is going on. And now nobody is talking. When you go inside the market, any junction you come, you see outside with a barrel. And if you ask the line, they, they will tell you that uh, this is the people that pack their goods for them. This is the people that do their offload for them. When you go at the middle, at the uh, junction of the road, you will see them. When you go to the, every pack, as far as the, our markets are concerned, this is what they are doing. They are coming with all strategies. Yesterday, day before yesterday, I saw them with this Peugeot, this uh, vehicle that the Northern has used to do transportation. Because when I travel to North, that is where, where I saw that motor in large number. I saw the Tony Mars. So, Aosa is full of that motor. Because of uh, this uh, lockdown, all of them closed uh, uh, their mouth with the first mask and they separate them on the seat, three, three each seat, but the door do not open. I asked the old people that, that is staying around that place, say, look at this vehicle. Now, is it not Aosa? Fulani is in this vehicle. But and that vehicle is coming from Port Harcourt. The vehicle is facing to Imo State. So all these things they are doing. But I don't know why our leaders are the people killing us instead of them to fight this uh, coronavirus and the Boko Haram. Because all the whole country, the coronavirus have hit. None, their government is behaving this way. And why are they doing this to us? If they are not ready, let them shift. Let another person take charge. Do you know that because of the day we uh, announced the uh, bucket of uh, Nigeria, uh, other state government, they want to sell bucket to the masses, 5,000, hand sanitizer, 2,000, without that, they will not open market. After they revise it, do you know what they did? They appoint 17 man committee that will take care of the market. Now, the market will open on 9 a.m. and shut down in 3 p uh, shut down by 3 p.m. That's if they catch you inside the market, they will collect money from you. Do you know what happened yesterday? So, because there is no how somebody will meet up and open market, before you clean up your shop and do one or two things, you will see three o'clock. Immediately, just two minutes after three, you will see people shouting, old women, young girls running along the line, then still arrest some people yesterday. So I don't know why they want to make money with this disease. Are they importing this disease for us 
they are telling us uh, 200 people i have heard that you must spend two weeks in an isolation center or uh, they will quarantine you for two weeks before confirming you as a a, a, a coronavirus uh, uh, positive but now when night come and go the next morning we have 200 people this, the next day you will hear 200 people these people they inside the uh, uh, isolation center before this time or they just find them th that day you see what they are doing with us but god chuko kikabiyama will fight for us they are punishing us they are weakening us no food no money i want what other contracts have given to their citizens but no kind of thing they are doing to us here a whole catholic church was given a bag of rice a whole catholic church that have not less than 100 members let me just sell it like that more than 100 members a bag of rice but these people are still doing what they are doing but all of them that are doing this thing but the ones that have left uh, abu do ibona they are not living there let chukwo kikabiyama fight our battle and god will fight our battle god they are fighting our battle thank you mazoni i will stop here may chukwo kikabiyama bless and guide you mighty name of chukwo kikabiyama thank you we must continue call on the line Call Mazo on. Nibe. good morning monitoring spirit go ahead please you have tried for them. We will all see them. Then you tell me for you don't support the Kadiama. There again, you will get there. Oh yes, no guy, no team, no friends, no family. But for the Kadiama, for the Kadiama, they know that they know that when they get hard, they are not bad. They are not like the Kadiama for the Kadiama. I can't support the Kadia, I'm not free me any land on this thing. And I can't come. 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 I can't Emotive, <laughs> ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
Unfortunately, we lose that color, and this is where we draw the segment for this morning segment. And having said that, dear friends across the globe, the message is simple this morning. Don't look at them that they are what they are not. Anybody invading Biafra land is evil. Number one. Number two, no matter their number, let them come more. All we ask you is to be at work, be at alert, understand what is happening. Community youth leader, all of you understand that is the land of your ancestors. They want to drink water in the Atlantic Ocean. We will give them plenty of water to drink. You are pretending. You don't know. Nothing is happening. You are pretending. They will kill you. We will join you among the heroes day and heroines day. But that will not be your portion. That will not be your portion. If we must fall, we will tell them how it's going to be. But I tell you, they come with Gwenguru. They will live on foot. That is a promise. I will sign off from here. Remain focused. Remain Biafra. Look for IPOB and join. Look for IPOB and join. It's not about what is what you expect or what you don't expect. It is about getting ready to go home. I sign off from here and I say God be with you. Biafra's God Talent exclusive. After this heavy rain, please let the sun rise. So in danger, siblings and more that all day long we have been ruled by strangers.
I know you can feel our anguish, but don't let us perish in the hands of our enemies. enemies. enemies.